There are two connection types used in this demo. This is direct connection. This is connected with a router. This connection is for DHCP mode. Please open WISnet's S2E configuration tools. Press device search to search the module. Make sure all information is correct before TCP communication. Network configuration shows modules network details. Default IP address is 192.168.11.2. Change to DHCP mode. Please remember to connect the module to AP. Select DHCP mode and press Apply Settings. The module updates the IP address provided from the AP. There are three modes for TCP. The default mode is TCP server mode. You could change to TCP client mode. Please select the TCP client. And remember to provide the remote host's IP address. Press apply settings to confirm your setups. The module will auto reset. Press search and it shows updated information. You could try to use TCP mixed mode. Mixed mode will change modes by itself. Providing both TCP client and server information. Select Mixed Mode and press Apply Settings. Module will work as TCP Mixed Mode. Under Operation Mode is Setting Port Number. Module's default port number is 5000. These are the default serial settings. The testing will mainly based on default parameters setup. Please open WizUR tools for serial communication. All commands required to ends with a enter key. Li checks or set the local IP address. Set the IP address is Li with new module IP address. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending Li command will check the module's IP address. It showed the IP address after the command word Li. Change to DHCP mode to collect IP address. Use IM1 to set into DHCP mode. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending IM command will check the network mode. It showed the network mode as DHCP mode. Op checks or set operation mode. Use OP1 to set into DCP server. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending off command will check the operation mode. It showed the operation mode as TCP server. Change to TCP client mode. Use OP0 to set into TCP client. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending off command will check the operation mode. It showed the operation mode as DCP client. Change to DCP mixed mode. Use OP2 to set into DCP mixed. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending off command will check the operation mode. It showed the operation mode as DCP mixed mode. There are four commands for serial setup. The first one is baud rate. BR with number, 0 to 14, will set the baud rate. BR12 sets into 115,200. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending BR command checks the baud rate. It showed the baud rate setting is correct. The second one is data bit. DB plus 0 or 1 will set the data bit. DB1 will set into 8 bit. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending db command will check the data bit. It showed the data bit is 8-bit. The next one is parity. PR plus 0 or 1 or 2 will set the parity. PR 0 sets into none. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending PR command will check the parity. 
It showed the parody is none. The last one is stop bit. SB plus 0 or 1 will set the stop bit. SB0 sets into 1 bit. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending SB command will check the stop bit. It showed the stop bit is 1 bit. RH changes the destination IP address. Set the IP address as RH plus new destination IP address. Setting commands won't have any response. Sending RH command will check the destination IP address. Destination IP address has been updated. For serial command details, please refer to the description below. There are two commands to save the settings. The first command is SV. SV will save all your changes. Setting commands won't have any response. The next command is reboot. Entering RT will receive response. Reboot response has returned. At mode response will show after reboot. For testing, I will use Li to check the IP address. The module had set into DHCP mode. The result shows the IP address has changed to DHCP server's assigned IP address. Exit command mode for TCP communication is required. X is the command to leave command mode. The module has changed to gateway mode. After exited command mode, the status of the module has changed to open. By searching the module, the module's status will change to open. You could start using TCP to communicate. This is TCP server demo. After exited command mode, please use socket tester in TCP client. After pressing connect, you could communicate with the module. This is TCP client demo. After exited command mode, please use socket tester in TCP server. After pressing listen, you could communicate with the module. This is TCP mixed mode demo. After exited command mode, please use socket tester in TCP client. After pressing connect, you could communicate in TCP server. Now we communicate in TCP client. Socket testers needs to change to TCP server. You could directly communicate without changing modes.